Ooh, I'm here. Better not be a giant about to come take my cow. Okay. We are back with another part of the adventures of Kitty Fluff. So, as you can see, I bought a cow. It's a couple of chickens. We have a carriage. <laughs> Beautiful. And I'm broke again. Mainly because something's gonna happen with the house later. I'll show that whenever it's done. So for now, since we're gonna do the college of Winterfell. Where do you want to go? Climb and back, and we'll be off. The beautiful thing about actually having the carriage at your place, which it cost 500 gold. I can't wait here forever. Yes, you can, because I fucking paid you. Oh, is steady. You don't have to pay for them to actually take you anywhere. Ever. Yes, adventure. And Kona chose this one. No, I'm saying you chose this one. Also, I really do appreciate you guys tuning in to these things. We need coin down here, and you're not bringing home any. And you'd have me do what? Join the college and prance about casting spells all day? Don't just walk away from me. Where do you think you're going? To the inn for a drink, of course. Where else could I even go in this contest? Faismian, you won't leave here alive! Yeah, yep, this is a scripted fight if you have dragons. Oh. Oh. But I'm here to die. This! How many sister didn't die? Slay it! Slay the dead! He's not my sister didn't die, she's a more big quest. And as you can see, my horse is still very much in existence. I don't know how, but it is. He's clear of the college. I'll sell just about anything if it's worth my time. Keep that in mind, will you? Wasn't by choice, I can tell you that. Options were in short supply. Branmir and I grew up here, and nearly any money I make, he drinks away. Without the coin to pack up and leave, I decided to take the trading. Very funny. I'm sure you've noticed that Winterhold isn't exactly overflowing with people. So I'll sell whatever I can. If it's worth putting a price on, you can bet I'll do it. I've been burned a few times, made a few bad deals. But mostly, I come out on top. You said something about the bad deal. Yeah, it was stupid of me. I shouldn't have believed the story and just refused the trade. But I didn't, and now I'm stuck with this worthless junk. What was the story? Some line about this clothing and Ingol Barrow. He said it was worth more than its weight in gold if I took it back there. Something about placing it back in Ingol's chamber, I don't know. What was I thinking? Even if it were true, I'm not setting foot in some ancient tomb filled with who knows what. I could look into it for you. I don't even care anymore. You want to check it out? Fine. I'll sell you the thing for 50 gold and then it's your problem. I'll take that claw for 50 gold. Fine, here you go. You get killed on account of this thing? It's not my fault. Got it? 
But I suppose if it does actually turn out to be worth something, let me know, will you? So I'm not sure if she can actually scriptly die, but she is needed to at least get the Coral Dragon Claw. And as I've mentioned, the Dragon Claws are insanely important to what they say. So she said All it's right, important then. for Yingle Barrow, which means I will do that later. And hey, you don't have to worry about your brother drinking away your problems anymore, because, uh... Yeah, he did. So... Hey, bye! I used to be an adventurer like you. And I took an arrow in the knee. Cross the bridge at your own peril. The way is dangerous, and the gate will not open. You shall not gain entry. Why are you out here? I am here to assist those seeking the wisdom of the college. And if, in the process, my presence helps to deter those who might seek to do harm, so be it. The more important question is, why are you here? May I enter the college? Perhaps. But what is it you expect to find within? I want to unravel, unravel the mysteries of Athirius. Ah, the immortal plane. It is said to be the source of all magic. This is a noble goal, indeed. It would seem that the college has what you seek. The question now is what can you offer the college? Not just anyone is allowed inside. Those wishing to enter must show some degree of skill with magic. A small test, if you will. I'll take your test. Then. Excellent. Those invested in restoration magic find healing hands to be essential. Can you cast it on me? That would prove your skill. I don't know that spin. No? Well, if you think you're capable of it, then I'd be happy to provide it to you for a mere 30 gold. Or you can try your luck with one of the court wizards around Skyrim. They also sell spells. Okay, this is for the spin. Here you are. Now I'm anxious to see you cast it. Normally I always get healing hands right off the bat, but considering I wasn't gonna mainly do magic, it didn't rip her. Well done indeed. I think you'll be a superb addition to the college. Welcome, apprentice. I'll lead you across the bridge. Once you're inside, you'll want to speak with Mirabel Irvine, our master wizard. Please, follow me. So basically what healing hands is, is as it says, you get to heal your target for 10 seconds, so it's really, really good when it comes to your followers. So like if Fandal's bitch ass keeps getting hurt. The college is an asset to Skyrim, even if it goes unnoticed or unappreciated. Yeah, or constantly bonked by traps. That's the fucking cool part, she does You can run ahead, but I just prefer to walk with her. Now this one I will have to watch time because the quest line can be pretty lengthy and yeah, this is death if you fall off of it unless you fall in the water below. And I'll eventually show you guys what's crazy about this bridge later. Well this is one of the main factions. Winter holds glory days may lie behind it. But the college lives on. And just like that. What you learn here will last you a lifetime. Several if you're talented. I believe I've made myself rather clear. Yes, of course. I'm simply trying to understand the reasoning behind the decision. You may be used to the Empire bowing to your every whim, but I'm afraid you'll find the Thalmor received no such treatment here. 
You are a guest of the college, here at the pleasure of the Archmage. I hope you appreciate the opportunity. Yes, of course. The Archmage has my thanks. Very good. Then we're done here. No, that's just how people look whenever they have spells getting ready to cast. Also, can I state that right there? Remember, drink these, the Archmage. That man. Welcome to the college. I was told to come see you. Another new student. I'm surprised at how many of you there are lately. Well, first you'll need these. While you're not required to wear them, you may find them more to your liking than your current clothes. I'll give you a brief tour, and then we'll get you to your first class. Are you ready to begin? I'd love to have a look at out. Wonderful. Please follow me, and don't wander off. The College of Winterhold has been a fixture in Skyrim for thousands of years. The prominent feature here is the Hall of the Elements. It's our primary location for lectures, practice sessions, and general meetings. The Arcanium is located above the Hall, and the Archmage's quarters above that. While technically in charge of the College, the Archmage's responsibilities often keep him occupied. Thus, I run the day-to-day -day operations. Now, if you'll please follow me, I'll show you the living quarters. Unfortunately, we've had to implement more stringent entry procedures due to some problems with the local Nords. We don't anticipate any real violence, but it never hurts to be prepared. Stuff. Your robes will always change, I believe, according to what magic house you are more prominent in. So that must mean my destruction is the highest. Or not. I should have gotten restoration. Oh well. Shut my warm mouth. Either that or it gives it whatever's the lowest. Which is between destruction and illusion. Our newest members are housed here, in the Hall of Attainment. I'll ask that you please keep your voice down while inside, as others may be working on research or delicate experiments. Now I'll show you to your quarters. You're going to be sharing space with your fellow apprentices, who you'll meet shortly. This is where you'll be staying. This bed and desk are yours. Please try and be considerate of others. Now, let's go back to the Hall of the Elements, where most of the members gather for lectures and study sessions. Chica, you get to wait. You just showed me a place that has stuff. <clears throat> Initially, you'll be learning from Tolfdir, one of our most esteemed wizards. Actually, market. Tolfdir is likely already addressing the new apprentices. Go on in, and if you have any problems, let one of our senior members know. Because I 
don't have the... I did just chill. <coughs> welcome, welcome. We were just beginning. Please, stay and listen. So, as I was saying, the first thing to understand is that magic is, by its very nature, volatile and dangerous. Unless you can control it, it can and will destroy you. Sir, I think we all understand that fairly well. We wouldn't be here if we couldn't control magic. Of course, my dear, of course. You all certainly possess some inherent natural ability. That much is not being questioned. What I'm talking about is true control, mastery of magic. It takes years, if not decades, of practice and study. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Please, please. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Eagerness must be tempered with caution, or else disaster is inevitable. But we've only just arrived here. You've no idea what any of us are capable of. Why not give us a chance to show you what we can do? You've been quiet so far. What do you think we should do? Safety should be more important than anything. Well, your classmates certainly seem to disagree with you. Oh, don't listen to him. We can do it. Just give us a chance. All right, let's settle down. I suppose we can try something practical. In continuing with our theme of safety, we'll start with wards. Wards are protective spells that block yes. magic. I'll teach you all a ward, and we'll see if you can successfully use it to block spells, all right? Would you mind helping me with the demonstration? Are you at all familiar with ward spells? I don't know any ward spells. That's all right. I can teach you a very basic ward, one that's enough for the purposes of this lesson. Now, if you'll just stand right over there, I'll cast a spell at you, and you block it with the ward. Here we go. Don't remember if it's under alteration? No. Ah, there it is. Over there, please. Just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Ding now, dong. cast the ward spell and keep it up. You have to keep your ward up, or else this won't work. I don't want it to is hurt up. you. Over there, please. Just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Now, cast the ward spell and keep it up. Hold still. Excellent work. Well, I think this is an excellent start. I'd like you all to continue practicing with wards, please. I think perhaps we're ready to begin exploring some of the various applications of magic throughout history. The college has undertaken a fascinating excavation in the ruins of Sarthol nearby. It's an excellent learning opportunity. I suggest we meet there in a few hours and see what awaits us inside. That's all for now. Thank you. You are new, yes? Have you mastered the expert level destruction spells yet? That's far beyond my level of skill. Is it? This is disappointing. Jezargo hoped there might be one who could keep pace with his accomplishments. You seem excited to be here. Oh yes. Jezargo hopes to find things that will make him a more powerful mage here. Hopefully, small things that fit inside pockets and will not be noticed if they are missing. Why did you become a student at the college? Mages in Cyrodiil are all about politics. The Synod in the College of Whispers are too busy guarding secrets to bother to teach. Skyrim was not Gisargo's first choice, but Winterhold is removed from politics, dedicated to study. This is the place for Cesargo to become great. You seem very sure of yourself. There is much for Cesargo to be sure of. There is skill in magic, there is charm, and there is a strong will. Cesargo will be successful. Of this there is no doubt. 
Not everything is a competition, you know. Oh, but you are wrong. The only reason you could disagree is because you are losing so badly you cannot see it. Until next time. New here too, eh? I'd hoped I wouldn't be the only Nord, but I should have known better. Why aren't there many Nords at the college? Magic is shunned by most. If it can't be swung over your head and used to crack skulls, most Nords want nothing to do with it. Magic is seen as something for elves and weaker races. No offense, of course. Not at all. I consider it a blessing. My family was convinced coming here was a death sentence, or worse. It took years of insisting that this is what I'm meant to do. Why did Nords have a problem with the college? Well, look at the evidence. Nords generally don't trust magic, so it's not off to a good start. Throw in the Oblivion Crisis, which was caused by magic users, and the troubles now with the Aldmeri Dominion, who are elves and magic users. And finally, take the fact that the college is the only thing left standing after most of Winterhold was destroyed. It's all fairly damning. All right, then. Skyrim could not be more different from elsewhere, but magic... Another new magic apprentice, I see. Are you of the sort that believe you're here to change the world? Or are you only in it for yourself? I assure you that I shall be watching you, all of you, very closely. I want to punch you. You have a very punchable face. I'd like to know more about the Talmor. Now that stability has been established between the Dominion and the Empire, we seek only to help Skyrim. To guide its people through this time of transition. To help lead them to a better future. What is it you do here? I am an advisor to the Archmage. The Thalmor wish to promote relations with your college. I am at the Archmage's disposal if he requires advice. Does the Archmage often ask for advice? Perhaps not as often as he should. In time, I believe he will be more trusting. Okay, bye! Where's that other bitch? You are relatively new here, are you not? I have noticed you, but we have not spoken. No, we haven't. Then allow me to introduce myself. I am Savos Arin, Archmage of the College of Winterhold. I am quite content to see nearly any aspect of magic explored and investigated here. But I do not and will not approve of any research or experiments that cause purposeful harm to your fellow members of the college. Are we clear? Dangerous research must be a problem here. Not often, no. Some risks must be taken, to be sure. I am simply trying to avoid untimely deaths. We also must make an effort to avoid worsening what Skyrim thinks of us. What's the purpose of the college? Purpose? I should think it's self-evident. Magic is a true power. Not something to be shunned by commoners, or treated as an amusing diversion by politicians. It shapes worlds, creates and destroys life. It deserves proper respect and study. The college is a place where we can focus on that, without the pressures of the world weighing down on us. Yeah, the other Khajiit is very cocky as shit, but he's needed for like some pretty interesting missions. I'd like to know more about the college's history. I've seen documents dating back to the late Second Era. Beyond that, it's hard to say. Events in the last several hundred years resulted in a significant loss of our history, I'm afraid. What happened in the last few hundred years? The Great Collapse, as it has come to be known. An unfortunate natural disaster that ravaged the area. The college fared far better than the city of Winterhold, but it was not left untouched. What caused the Great Collapse? No one is sure of the cause. Some believe the eruption of Red Mountain had far-reaching consequences that were only felt years later. I know there are some who have blamed the college, said that we were responsible. I assure you this is not the case. 
Tell me more about the Great Collapse. The Sea of Ghosts practically came alive. No one was expecting it. Monstrous waves battered the shore for weeks on end. Winterhold was ancient and weathered, but it couldn't withstand the sea's fury. Entire districts of the city were lost overnight. The waves receded in time, but the damage was irreversible. Most residents of Winterhold abandoned what was left of the city. The college survived, and so here we remain. Uh, until next time. So, this is why... Basically, that the town is a town instead of a city, like everything else. And it is the reason. College is literally standing on a small pile of rocks, held together by a very small base, and the bridge is just floating. I trust you're not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, Fred? My job is to serve the Jarl, not waste time talking with travelers. And why are you wasting time trying to talk to me then, bitch? What's your business here in Winterhold? Hmm. Should have known. Not that it matters anymore. No one bothers coming to Winterhold for any other reason. You're the Yarl? I'm looking for work. Winterhold has lost much of its history, and with that much of its power. I aim to change that. I've heard rumors of the resting place of the Helm of Winterhold. The very same helm that Jarl Hansa wore in the First Era. Hansa was in line to be High King of Skyrim, you know. Having that might get the ear of the other holds, and give me some authority. I'll recover the helm. Good. I'll have a sum of gold waiting for your return. Mm-hmm. Safe travels. Right, so at least we have a question. Keep clear of the cotton. I have to wonder. What does the Dragonborn do once he's been summoned by the Greybeards? Can the Thum be taught? Like any skill? No. I'm sorry, could you describe the smell? Like some horrible monster was turned inside out and then exploded. What did you do? It was a minor miscalculation. I've already corrected it for future experiments. This... This is why people have a problem with your college, Nelikar. My days at the college are long behind me, but I prefer to stay close by. You're with the college? No. Gods no, not for years. I left Winterhold for some time, and returned to stay here at the inn. Why would you leave here at an inn? I still have research that keeps me busy, and being here in Winterhold ensures I have access to former colleagues. Until next time. If there's anything you need, just let me know. What can you tell me about Winterhold? I'm afraid there's not much to be said. 
Vinterhold is hardly what it used to be. You can talk to Birna if you need to buy anything. She doesn't have much, but could certainly use the coin. And then there's our little inn. Most of the business we get is from folks here to visit the college. Though even that's dried up some. People say there's someone in Riften that can change your face. Make you look completely different. Do you believe that? Just say the word if you need a drink or something to eat. Why is it so empty here? You mean the inn or Winterhold? I suppose it's the same answer either way. Winterhold's fallen on hard times to say the least. Most folk packed up and left years ago. A few of us are either too stubborn or too crazy to go, so we do our best to make a living. What's place you have there? It's not much, but we get by. Very little money passes through Winterhold anymore. But if there's one thing you can count on, it's folks needing a drink now and then. Mm, yeah, mm-hmm. Huh? Be careful! My days at the college are long behind me. So now we have to go here. Pretty much, that's what most of the freaking followers do, is they'll always block doorways. It's relatively annoying, but it's part of their charm. Now, as much as this is a magic-based uh, story plot, I'm probably not going to use magic as much, considering he is not very magic savvy. Oh, they go, they go. Rip, go. Before you even ask, yes, I have an ancestry steeped in magic, and no, I don't want to talk about it. Yes, I know Winterhold used to be full of my kind, and no, I don't care that they're all gone now. Does that cover everything? We have literally been introduced. No, I suppose we haven't. Relina Marion of House Telvani. First of my family to leave Morrowind in a long time. Now I'm here to study conjuration. That's what's important. All right, then.
I don't know why the others aren't here. Good to see Skyrim still has such fine people. You give an old man hope. What are we looking for? Anything. Anything at all that might be of interest. That's why I adore this location. We have no idea what we're going to find. And if along the way my message about the dangers of magic should happen to sink in for a few students, that would be a happy coincidence. I'm ready. Let's go. All right. Please stay close to me while we're inside. It should be safe, but it's yes. always better to be cautious. Yeah, the other two should also be here, so I don't know why they're not. But they'll pop out of nowhere. I'm not so sure we should be here. Who knows what we might find in here? The earliest Nord settlements in Skyrim. It was also the largest. Sacked by the elves in the infamous Night of Tears, not much is known about what happened to Sarthol. This is an exciting opportunity. Well, are there any questions before we begin? What's so important about this place? We're particularly interested in the prevalence of magical seals placed on the tombs here. It's rather unlike anything we've encountered. I don't have any more questions. What would you like me to do? Ah, yes. Hmm. Well, why don't you see if you can assist Arniel Gain? He's one of our scholars, here working on cataloging our finds. I expect he'd appreciate some help in locating any additional magical artifacts here in the ruins. Any enchanted items will do. The usefulness of the enchantment is irrelevant. If you find anything, the class can look it over. Now, let's see. What shall we have the rest of you do? Brelina, my dear, why don't you search for warding magics? Anything designed to keep people out. Don't interact with them, just identify them. Ormond, please search that area over there. See if you notice any residual energies, alive or undead. All right, everyone. Let's be careful, but have fun. I'm not seeing signs of any warding magics at all. Either they're not here, or they were... Please be careful here. The site isn't entirely secured. I wonder if everyone else would be so happy to rifle through the bones of their ancestors. Jazargo finds nothing but dust in these ruins. This treasure here, something to make Jezargo a powerful wizard. Can you imagine what it was like living here so long ago? The first men in Tamriel, here. Don't touch anything! Dolph Deer sent me to help you. What? Ah, yes. You. I remember you. You're going to help? That's fine. Just... Just don't make a mess of my work. I've only looked through a portion of this section. You, uh... You can look around in the chambers just north of here. Try and be careful, all right? We don't want to damage anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, then. Ring. 
What in the world was that racket? Is everything all right? I'm trapped in here. How in the world did that happen? I pulled an amulet off the wall. Really? Perhaps the amulet is important somehow. Is there some way you can use it? Do you see that? Some kind of resonance. You and the wall. It must be connected to the amulet. I wonder what effect might your spells have. Please be careful here. The site isn't entirely secured. Did you see that? Well, would you look at that? This appears to lead somewhere. Let's see where it goes. So you wish to master the arcane arts? I'm gonna see what you have. Adapted, adapt robes. Books, candlelight, mage light. Oak flesh, stone flesh, and gems. Until next time. Please be careful here. The Just site isn't forward, entirely please. secured. This is highly unusual, and very interesting. <coughs> Why in the world would this be sealed off? What is this place? set in motion a chain of events that cannot be stopped. Judgment has not been passed, as you had no way of knowing. Judgment will be passed on your actions to come, and how you deal with the dangers ahead of you. This warning is passed to you because the Sigic Order believes in you. You, Mage, and you alone have the potential to prevent disaster. Take great care and know that the Order is watching. I... I swear I felt something rather strange just then. What just happened? Some sort of ghost or apparition appeared. It spoke to me. I'm afraid I didn't see anything. Can you tell me more about what you saw? It says something about danger ahead and the Sigic Order. The Sigic Order? Are you quite sure about that? That's very odd. And danger ahead? Why, that doesn't make any sense at all. The Sigics have no connection to these ruins, and no one's seen any of their order in a long time. Perhaps we should take a look inside these coffins. No. Now, please do be careful. Who knows what we're going to find? What's the Sigic order? They were a group of mages with a history that predates the Empire. Very powerful, very secretive. No one's seen them in well over a hundred years. They vanished, along with their sanctuary on the Isle of Arteum. I have no idea what connection they'd have to this place. Why is a Sigic Order contacting me? I have no idea, but it's fascinating. 
Assuming it's true, of course. The Isle of Arteum disappeared over a hundred years ago, and no one has seen them since. And yet now, suddenly, they've chosen to contact you. Why, it's intriguing. If nothing else, I'd take it as a compliment. The Sidics have only ever dealt with those they feel worthy. Mm-hmm. This is simply fascinating. All right, then. Yeah, I'll just let him move it away. <laughs> this is simply fascinating. Bruh, just walk. Hey, guys, I think he thinks this is simply fascinating. Be prepared to defend yourself. Never seen anything like this in Nordic ruins before. Why just look at all these coffins? This bears closer inspection. I'd like to stay a while and examine this. You, however, should press on. See if you can find whatever this vision of yours mentioned. But if it is truly dangerous, be careful. Go on ahead. I'll be sure and catch up with you before long. I've got your back. What do you want me to carry? Let's get going then. Deeper into Sarathal we go. Giant plate. <laughs> yep, now we're back in our usual. convinced Feindall's gonna die to a very, very stupid reason. And we're all just gonna look at him and then blink and say, really, bruh? That's what killed you? Kill him through countless other things, but they killed us by something small. Oh, 
blow this up. But it's just a wall. Because, you know, different coloration like that totally means there's something hidden behind it. Iron dagger. I raise a jug to your iron dagger. The jug is a very versatile weapon. You can fill it with water, poison, alcohol, and then smack someone over the head with it. So. Use it and you Okay, so this is what I was talking about like, sometimes, the puzzles. So this one needs to be a hawk, because you can see behind it. That's already a whale. This needs to be a snake. <coughs> this needs to be a hawk. And then this needs to be a whale. got pelted with a bunch of shit. sword. Why not? Thing that is dangerous. Forgot if I could shoot that or not. Nope. Okay, being in midair didn't hurt me. You're the only one that doesn't change. Okay, so which one do you change? You change this one. I almost have it right. Okay, so that one changes 
all of them by one. So. Take a while, guys. Just warning you. Or not. Hey. Okay. I thought it high time I caught up with you. Hi. This is simply fascinating. Take care now. Oh, now could be station. Yes, the lusty Argonian may give me. Don't worry about it. <clears throat> anyway, let's continue. Smooth, Fiendal. Turn the water into light. Pretty much. So therefore, oh. Oh yeah. Well now, would you look at that? I never imagined we'd find something like this. Why is this buried so far within Sarthol? Nothing uh, seems to work. Now. Keep it busy. I'll try to drain some of its power. Oh yeah. Yeah, that just opened me a whole new slew of a quest line. For I'll talk to you in a sec. Okay, I'm looking around first. Big glowy ball. This is simply fascinating. What is this thing? I have no idea. This is amazing. Absolutely amazing. The Archmage needs to be informed immediately. He needs to see this for himself. I don't dare leave this unattended. Can you return to the college and inform Sabo Saren of this discovery? Please, hurry. So, you know, nothing ever came bad of a big glow. What could this place be? Magical ball. Absolutely nothing at all could ever go wrong with that. I think the big chest should be just past this. Yeah, because there's a warp ball. She won't give me. Hey, this is actually needed for marriage, so that's actually useful. What word you gonna give me? 
flesh. Totally. Why would there anything? Why would there be anything wrong with a big, blowy ball? Totally nothing wrong. Nothing wrong. Ah. <laughs> uh, I've already done this quest line before, so I know exactly what happens. So before we go there, I want to come back home. So I can drop some stuff off. So I don't have owner for encumber problem, and I can take the stuff I was giving Fangdahl to carry, so I can put it in the chest. You know, all that good shit. Yeah, Paul, you just missed a big, glowy, magical ball. And a crypt. Alrighty. Hi, horse. Bye, horse. Hey, no. I've got your back. What do you want me to carry? Let's get going then. Kana's probably- Kana's still in the chat too, Pa, so no. <laughs> Takes 25 match points of damage and twice as much magical damage. Oh, okay, cool. These, I can actually disenchant one if I'm allowed to keep them. Get rid of that. Those amethyst. Why do I even have that? So, so, so. until I do that damn quest. You she was still here. All right. Let us continue. Oh, this quest. Just wanted to drop some shit off at home. You're going to be looking to hide from the corner. From the corner. Yeah, 
has an entire botanical garden inside of his place. And shelves upon shelves of stuff. What you learn here will last you a lifetime. It's no secret that the college's reputation in Skyrim is... tainted. I need to speak with you about Sarthal. Ah, please don't tell me that another one of the apprentices has been incinerated. I have enough to deal with right now. We found something in... we found something in Sarthal and... Tolfthir thinks it's important. Very well. I trust that you wouldn't be here were it not significant. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. Tolfdir normally looks after your little group, yes? Since he's apparently occupied, and I will need to see this discovery for myself, I think perhaps you should begin researching the subject. Speak with Urog in the Arcanium. See if he's aware of anything that matches your discovery. And good work. The next time you find yourself exploring Nordic ruins, Perhaps this will be helpful. Have you ever met the Sigic Order? Personally? No, not I. One of their number used to advise the Archmage when I was but an apprentice here. But that was a great many years ago. Before all the members of the Order were called back to the Isle of Arteum, and it disappeared entirely. Now, if you'll excuse me. Yep, and then he'll disappear. Nah, but that unusual gem I grabbed is actually needed for stuff later. Well, the quest I actually never have finished. We are now in the library! <coughs> you are now in the Arcanium, of which I am in charge. It might as well be my own little plane of oblivion. Disrupt my Arcanium, and I will have you torn apart by angry Atronox. Now, do you require assistance? Is there any college business I can assist with? If you're feeling adventurous, I'm always looking for someone to procure valuable books from some more dangerous locations. I'm ready for some adventure. Well, all right. Here. I scribbled down the last place I had heard about. Check it out, but be careful. Yeah. You can constantly go to him for those kind of missions. What do you have for sale? Assorted books. Scrolls. I'm sure you'll find something useful. I need to learn about something we found in Sarathal. I know Sarathal. what you want. Word travels fast around here. Discovered some big mystery, huh? Well, you don't even need to ask. No, I don't have anything for you. Not any more, anyway. The reason I haven't finished it is because there's literally 31 or 30 plus pieces of that gem you have to find throughout all of Skyrim. Closest I've been was 25, and then Steven deleted my uh, save file. You don't have anything that can help. I said not anymore. Orthorn stole a number of books when he ran off to Felglow Keep to join those summoners. Some kind of peace offering. I think one of those volumes may have had some relevant information. If you want them, you'll have to talk to Orthorn. All right, then. Let's 
Excuse me. Yes. Hi, Fandle. I care little for idle conversation. You there. But I have questions you for you. Conjuration you were in Sarthol, yes? It has come to my attention that something was found there. I don't like you. Yes, we did. I just informed the Archmage. I am well aware. Tolfdir is still in Sarthol, is he? I shall be expecting a full report from him when he returns. Why does this matter to you? Something was discovered in Sarthol that was significant enough that Tolfdir sent a new member of the college alone to deliver word. That sounds precisely like the sort of thing that should matter to everyone, especially me. Thank you for your help. You may go now. You may go now. Can we go up or down? Up. I have many important things on my mind. Your concerns are... You may go now. Are you quite sure we need to be speaking? I will kill you if you continue to talk to me. <laughs> I mean, most times I kill anyone who annoy the hell out of me, but I can't on this fucking play. Legendary dragons are more deadly than ancient dragons. They use a shell that can drain health, magicka, and stamina from its victims. Hmm? Who? Many of Skyrim's waterways are home to slaughterfish. Yeah, my horse is still popping up labeled as horse every time I teleport. So I technically have a horse that never dies. But never stays around. So I got some pros and cons. Everyone that was in the stream of the last one saw my horse die. And yet somehow it's here. I'll leave you right here. Go on, go disappear like you probably will. Have fun. Such a good horse. This is gonna be a bitch. I remember this place. Fight me. Watching your pie. 
<laughs> the yellow book of riddles. It's actually a red book. That's the best part. Did you just lick me again? being silly. Huh? What is it? Ah, uh, a test subject. Go my pets! Attack! Yeah, your pets aren't gonna do shit, dude. Even conceive. I can't conceive what now? Sorry, I, I can't hear you over the sound of my hammer smashing into your skull. is usually silly. And I love her. Ooh, paint all. Okay, this is a frost one. So. <laughs> that hurt. Hi. What? <laughs> Metal dead. And now for the feast. Oh, you're a vampire? Out of the way, meat. Well, you're gonna stay in there then, bitch. Out of the way, meat. You're also gonna stay in there. You guess you're one too? Yep, with your eyes. So all y'all get to stay in there. Bear of Markarth. I'll go ahead and take that. Coin purse. Go ahead and take that. So let's see. Any, many, miny. Bye. Huh? What was that? <laughs> So whoever was in this cage. Come on, I'll take that. 
Phaedra. Another Master Vampire. Balmer here. Khajiit, whose tail is still swaying in the wind as if he was alive. Lover. Or sister. Wolves. What was that? Go, boys! Over here! Attack! Casually uh, de de decapitate someone. Oh, you've saved me. Thank you so much. Who knows what they'd have done to me if you hadn't come along? I promise I'll help you get out of here. Now, where are the books? The, the books? Oh, I see. I, I thought perhaps. Well, I thought you'd come for me. But yes, the books. The caller will have them. She was most interested in one of the volumes. Although not interested enough to keep me from being locked up. You should literally get yourself to safety. Don't you need my help? You're right, I can just... I shall do my best. May as well just keep him around. If he gets killed, he gets killed. It's not his own fault. This is where they practiced uh, magic. But they're ready. Oh. Yeah. Now have that quest ready. Don't speak to me, meat. What was that? I didn't hear you over the sound of you dying. Never should have come here. Yeah. No.
benefit is at least I'm getting spells. Onto the keep. La -da 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 -da. Huh? Ritual stones. Mine now. Hi, Fandor. Doors of Oblivion. Where the bodies? got an accident. Hmm? Oh, I took a basket by accident. Come back here. You're the one running, dude. Why are you telling me to come back here? Can't hide from me. Ah! Hey, you guys are running from me. Over here! I like when they're all like, get back here when I'm going chasing after them. Shells, Briar Heart, I need. It's totally where they piss and shit. Lovely. What are you doing that for? Because y'all are in my way. You think, well, I just run into you. Okay, upstairs we go. library is just through here. We're getting close now. Okay, so then I want to go to this other one. Whee! Take that, I'll take that. 
that, and then use your jam, please. I need all the ones I can get. <sighs> okay, so while well, I'm in combat, of course not. It must have been nothing. Exactly, it was nothing. So just pretend you never heard anything. So what can I disenchant? Cool. So I did guess right about that. Bar from the other side. You're dead. <laughs> no. You're dead. Why did I ever come here? I don't know, why did you ever come here? That's a question only you can answer, D. There's nothing else valuable. let them fight as I go through shit. You know, because I already do more than that. So. Hi, guys. Huh? Ooh, Shana Giuliano. Finally get a full steel plate set, but yeah, I'll take it. I can always improve you and make you better than my helmet right now. Actually, no, I can't because my helmet is a mask from a dragon priest. to smite you, so just letting you know that. Okay, cool. Oh. It's a door. Spike, potion. Give me a lot of ice spike. Ritual chamber. So you're the one who barged into my home and laid waste to my projects. How nice to meet you. Who are you? Names no longer matter. You may refer to me as the Caller. Now, do you have a reason for making such a mess? 
I'm here for the books from the college. So you're just one of Aaron's lackeys. That's disappointing. You show real promise. You come here, kill my assistants, disrupt my work. You've annoyed me, so I don't think I'll be giving you anything. Perhaps we can come to an arrangement. An arrangement? After you've destroyed so much? Fine. Leave me the elf. You may go with your books. I, uh... Wait, what? He gets the books. I get you. It's very simple. But why? This little adventure of yours has cost me a number of test subjects. I need more, and you'll do nicely. You wouldn't do that, would you? You wouldn't leave me here with her. I'm waiting. Never should have come here. Hey. Everything worked out nicely, didn't it? I've got what I came for. Yes, you certainly do. You'll be going back to the college then. I, uh... I think perhaps I'll wait a bit before venturing there myself. Let this whole thing blow over, you know. Give certain parties a chance to forget what I may have done. Still, you've got me out of that cage. And I won't forget it. Thank you again. And good luck to you. No, you can actually give him to her, you just talk to her again and agree. Can you... can you possibly help Jazarko? Mages... Skyrim was not Jazargo. Jazargo has seen that Tofdir likes you. You must be very skilled with magic, yes? Jazargo is working hard, but cannot do it alone. Can you help with this? Jazargo has worked hard on learning new spells. Trying new things. This will make Jazargo stand out as a mage. But Jazargo works so hard there is no time to test his new spells. If you help with the test, help. this will make it Tail. easier. Jazargo will give you your death. <laughs> Is 
Sargo, where are you? This happens very I never would have very often. I haven't seen it with my own eyes. How rude, I was just talking to the Jasargo and then a dragon decides to come out of nowhere. Here you found some thing in Sartor. You think it could help make me a powerful mage? This thing, Jezargo has worked, but Jezargo worked. Jezargo will give you scrolls. You will use them and report the results. This is a good plan, no? You tell Jezargo when you are ready. Ha! <laughs> you can resist, can you? Let's see. This one, I think. Jezargo has designed it to be an excellent flame cloak, with a twist. It is especially potent against the undead, and should burn them to a crisp in no time. Jezargo gives you plenty of these scrolls, so you try them and return when you can say whether they work. Jezargo awaits word of how well his scrolls work. Urag can be very helpful. Just don't antagonize him. I think... If you're working on any experiments, please clean up after yourself. Silly dragons. Enchanting services are one of the few things that keep us in touch with the rest of Skyrim. Yeah, they brought it here. I'm working on some very important research, I assure you. And then the guy... The local Nords may not like us very much, but they don't seem to mind having access to enchanted weapons and armor. So, here we go. Back to talk to this guy. I don't want to see you treating any of these books poorly. Are we clear? Hundreds of years have gone into assembling this collection. It's going to stay pristine, understand? Here are the books that were missing. Well, well. And you seem to be in one piece. Thank you. I'll look these over and inform Mirabelle if I find anything relevant. Night of Tears, eh? I remember this one. Well, isn't that interesting? Did you read it yourself? If I recall it correctly, that has some interesting implications. You should mention that to Toldir. And here. I suppose you've earned these. Are there any special books you're looking for? As a matter of fact, there are. Have you ever heard of Shalador? Immensely powerful mage, back in the first era. Had an understanding of magic, few have ever matched. He holed himself up in Labyrinthian, and devoted all his time to research and study, but more than you would imagine possible. Since then, his writings have been scattered all over Skyrim, but are little use to anyone who can't translate them. I'm one of the few who can. I've heard whispers of more of his work having turned up. If you can track it down, it may prove useful to all of us. All right, then. He gave us a lot of books. All of which are skill books, if I remember correctly. Well, not that one. I think I did that one. Yeah, about that one. That's what I just 
red. I'm right behind you. What do you want me to carry? Lead on. I'm gonna go drop shit off at home. And honestly, I might probably call it and continue to do some more housework now that I have a little bit more funds. So, I'll catch you guys later. Thanks for everyone who dropped by.